What is going on guys? So today I wanted to show you Gorilla Tape Crystal Clear. Now, duct tape is super important. I, I, it's always good to keep a thing of duct tape around. Any, I, any dad, any grandfather knows that duct tape pretty much fixes just about anything, right? Uh, and this clear stuff is actually really, really cool. So I got a brand new package of this. Let me pull it out and show you. Um, I got a brand new package. I, I use it a ton. We use it for all sorts of stuff. It just allows you to do um, very heavy duty taping, but without being able to see it, right? Duct tape is not the most attractive look, uh, right? Obviously it's got that kind of that real, that real metallic look. This is completely clear. So let me open this up here and show you guys just how this looks. So when I peel this off, <clears throat> it's a smooth tape, okay? Um, it goes on glass very, very clearly, really nicely. Um, and you can also put it over colored items. So you can see it is completely clear. It looks almost like packing tape, right? You would almost put this in the packing tape category, but it is way more adhesive, much, much stronger, much stickier than you're gonna get from packing tape. So I wouldn't use this for packing tape, right? It's a little bit on the thick side. Um, I think it's a little bit overkill and it's obviously a little bit more expensive than you're gonna get a roll of packing tape for. But if you're going to be putting stuff on windows, if you wanna double stick something onto a window and you want it to be see-through and almost like you can't even see it, this works great there. Um, we buy it uh, for various different reasons. We use it to kind of seal off around different places. Um, it's waterproof, um, it sticks on there, it responds, it, it holds back water very, very well. Um, and it's just really, really strong tape. So if you're looking for um, a very strong adhesive tape that's similar to duct tape but is crystal clear definitely consider checking out the gorilla tape crystal clear version but guys as usual i hope this video was helpful for you and i'll see you in the next one